welcome back to this channel and in this video I want to show you a cool wheel component I created for one of my client. Now what this does is that it allows the users to generate a coupon in the site. Uh, let me walk you through on how this is done. First of all the user will enter his or her details and then after that uh, he or she will be submitting the form. After uh, submitting the form the wheel will spin and the coupon will be generated. Now in my case the generated coupon is 43 Ankit 50. Uh, more details of this coupon will be residing in the wheel itself. Okay. So as you can see here the coupon which was generated for me offers me 10% uh, off on 5 orders. Okay. Uh, the layout of this component is actually inspired from the Chindi Surfer website. Okay. Uh, one more thing is that this component is built using JavaScript. That means we can load this uh, whole component asynchronously. Okay, so let me give you a quick demo of what I am saying. I have uh, throttled the network so that you can see it better. Okay, notice something over the elements of this page. Okay, see something over here. Uh, as you can see initially in the DOM, the elements of the wheel component were not present. Well, that's because the script that is the main.js file uh, that injects these elements uh, was not executed yet. It will be executed after the initial content in the DOM like the CSS and images uh, are loaded. Now due to this the performance of the site increases because all the required resources of the uh, wheel uh, of the wheel component such as the image the images the markup and the CSS styling these all are loaded after the initial DOM has loaded. Okay and there's one more thing that in this component if I close the if I click on the close button then all the injected uh, all the injected uh, HTML code gets removed from the DOM okay let me show you as you can see as soon as I clicked on the cross button uh, the code that is injected from the main.js file gets removed from this from the DOM okay uh, so the perks of this is that the web page becomes very lightweighted and due to this the site becomes fast. Uh, now if you want uh, a tutorial on how I made this component then get, get this video 15 likes and be sure to mention about it in the comments. 